Hello YouTube, it is G-Force and we are in Charlotte, the truck. Ah, it's bright and early, 8 in the morning, Saturday, and I'm going to run into work quick. Uh, while I'm out there, we'll hit a couple stores, see what's out there in Raleigh. Alright, hang out with me, we'll do the the deal, you know. You guys know what I mean, right? Okay, guys, we are here outside the home base Target. Um, was here a couple days ago, but I just want to see with their resets what is new, what they got out in the shelves. So I gave them a couple days to get the old stuff out, get the new stuff in. Let's check them out. All right, starting off here. First thing I see is Super Saiyan Rose Goku Black. First time seeing that. Hulk and Mr. T. Very cool. Very cool. Got the Lola. Got Antok Merrick. Tikas up the wazoo. Got Dr. Evazon. Ahsoka. Obi-Wan. The Client. Um, Galen Urso. Lando, 501st, Thrawn, and Lando. So, yes, they did stock up. Uh, Ortiz Santana, X Pac Kane, Stacy Keebler, Lex, Mark Callis. This is going to be hard to pass up. I do need that Obi Wan, too. So, Scrape him off the pegs here. Got our Motu is looking light, so they might still be stocking that. Dinos look good. Galley Mimis, first time seeing that. Triceratops, ooh, that's really cool. I may wait on that long game. Triceratops is my favorite. Got our Victory Royale Fade Mask. Brutus Ghost, those are new, and I don't see anything new really in Pokemon. Yeah, some figures and stuff, Lucario. All right, well, let's see what's on the other side. Okay, so over here we got X Pac, Stacy Keebler, Rey Mysterio's Reckoning, got the Superwoman with the Starro, Thunder Frog. Big old halo piece. That's kind of cool. Transformers. Buzzworthy Bumblebee stuff. Starscream. Superman Horse. Black Adam. Adam Smasher. Cyclone and Hawkman. G.I. Joe's still nothing but uh, our reactions. And all the Black Panther stuff you see is right there. Claws. Shuri, Mask, and a Titan. Over here in NECA, they got the Toonie Terrors over here now. They've reset this a little bit. Got a Terminator, Dark Fate, some Frogs, some Vernon and Rat King, Flash Gordon still, Stranger Things, Plushies. Over here in LEGO, we got Optimus Prime, Seinfeld, Santa's House, Blacksmith House, Lunar Lander, Friends, Great Pyramid of Giza. City Express Passenger Train, really cool. Ghostbusters Echo 1, Jurassic Park set. Over here we have the UCS Land Speeder for $239. Got our helmets. That's a little different. Little Forest Endor set. That's kind of neat. Obi Wan Starship. R2, stuff we've seen, this we haven't seen, the Inquisitor Transport Scythe, have not seen the Ambush on Ferrix, comes with Cassian Andor, Luthan Rail, and Cyril Karn, can't even pronounce them, got the Mandalorian Starfighter, and for 169, the Justifier, Cad Bane, Toto, Omega, 
Hunter and Fennec Shand. Pretty cool. Okay, so coming back here to NECA. We got some alien stuff, some Bride of Chucky, It, Halloween Kills, Manga Spawn, Aliens, Demona, Demolition Gremlins, Frankie, Ace Ventura, Thing, Jaws, all kinds of aliens. And up here, got our little mishmash of stuff. New Apex figure, he looks pretty cool. And then Mr. Freeze, who's that back there? Mr. Freeze. And Pops, so pretty cool. Not a bad stop, so as Big Dub would say, you two feast your eyes on these sacks. Like getting sacks out of it. Alright, see you guys in a bit. So it's been a minute, but we are outside of Ollie's, um, waiting for them to open. They open at 9, it's a couple minutes away, but uh, yeah, with all the clearance and shit at Targets and Walmart, I figured let's check it out and see if Ollie's got any of it. Alright, so they do have Lando's for $9.99. I got them cheaper than that. $14 for the Tango Warrior. $7.99 for Overwatch. $3.99 for Reaction Boondock Saint. I only got the one. But uh, not a lot in the first toy aisle that I see. And what's this? $15.99? I don't have this Black Widow, so yeah, we'll buy that. Um... I'll look around. If I see anything else, I'll let you guys know. $5.99 on those lower Shang Chi's. $12.99 on the Snake Eyes bike. I do have a pretty cool uh, comic and graphic novel section. Bomber Command, Punisher, Harley Quinn, Batman. All kinds of good stuff. Comes with a little Lego minifig. So yeah, pretty cool stuff. Alright, so we are outside of Target in North Hills. Fucking construction everywhere. It was a nightmare just to even get to this place. But, uh, yeah. Haven't been here in a few weeks, so let's see what they got. Alright, we got Lex Luthor, Gold Label, Superwoman, Owlman, Manga Spawn. Cool. Dad, come and find me. Alright. Hazmat suit, $10. <laughs> Somebody just farted in the aisle. That's nice. This looks like Reset City here. Reckoning, Undertaker, Mean Mark Callis. We got our Galaxy Pals, Galactic Pals. That's it for them. Some He-Man stuff. Masters of the Universe, whatever you want to call it. Lightyear. Got the T-Rex. Hammond Collection. Bunch of dinos. And here we got some older Fortnite, Halo, and assorted video game stuff. Okay, over here, we got a Mix Master. I don't believe I've ever seen him. And a sweet. The Joker, Superman, Build a Horse, Two Pack. A, G.I. Joe, Titan, nothing for Marvel. This store is usually pretty decent, but they're a little behind on the reset, it seems like. Alright, coming back into the NECA Funko section, we got the Gigantosaurus, Green Goblin, Pops, 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 some NECA stuff, Alpha Predator, some Turtle stuff. Gundams. Oh, 
Razor claws. Do have the uh, new cat woman. I haven't made my mind up yet on her. But yeah, it doesn't look like anything different from what we've seen. Uh, prototype suit aliens. Oh my gosh. Yeah, all prototype suits, no Geiger. So, yeah, I don't know, guys. I think that's going to do it today. I'm just going to hit work, grab my laptop, and think I'm going to call it a day. All right, talk to you all soon. I did find some clearance. We got the Rise of Evil for $9.89. We got Thresh for $5.99, which is tempting, but he's kind of traffic conish. Got Groot for $16.09. $8.99 for the Evil Lynn Glow in the Dark Pop and T shirt. Size mediums. Let's see what else we can find here. Skelegod, $8.99. So there's a little bit of clearance, but I'm going to go through these racks and see what I can find. Just Lego clearance, that would make me happy. If they have a set that I would like anyway. But, let's see. No prices on it. Alright, I'm going to browse around a bit and see if I can find anything. Alright, we are outside Target on Glenwood North Raleigh Target. I wasn't happy with that last one, kind of left a sour taste in my mouth. I don't like to end on a poor note, so let's see what they get. Alright, so we got a Thor Ragnarok just hanging out over here. A couple of them. Or Ravenger Thor, I mean. In the NECA section. Oh, we got a couple Terminators. Mondo Gecko. Some aliens down there, some frogs in the back back, but nothing screaming by me. Hey, okay, out here we got Luke's X-Wing, already damaged, Tika, ton of them, Lola, if it wasn't 40 bucks I'd be tempted because pretty cool, pretty cool, alright let's see what we got. We got dinos. Everybody's been having the uh, Hammond Collection T Rex, which is a good sign. Loud cart. Got the Ahsoka Mission Fleet. Mo2. Oh, there's Migs Mayfield. Haven't seen him yet. And we got the client. We got Leia from Return of the Jedi. Galen Erso. Antoc Merrick. Who's that in the back? Galen or so again. Come on guys, get in there. And more Tikas. So Migs, come along with me. Uh, let's see what we got wrestling wise. Hulk, Mr. T. Batista, Kane, Stacy Keebler. Nothing in AEW. Some Gundam. And anime. Over here we have Wolverine and Siren. We got some of our retros, but nothing new there. Getting some new Black Panther in. Small stuff. G.I. Joe's, Page Punchers, Superwoman, Build a Horse, Black Adam Cyclone, Adam Smasher, and Dr. Fate. That looks to be about it, guys and girls. Let's uh, go check out NECA Funko. Just as I say that, I come around the corner and we have the Brute Ghost, or Brutus Ghost. But these I have never seen. Master Series, or Master Grade Series Fortnite. 28 points of articulation. You got Oro, Midas Rex. And that looks to be about it. Some Battle Beasts. Wildlife pack. They get some cool stuff in Fortnite. I don't mind them. Video game goodness. Sonic, Mario, all that fun stuff. 
Pokemon. I didn't show him last time very well, but Lucario. All right, that's it for this app. I did overlook these. We got the regular TIE Fighter, ATST, and the Micro Galaxy Squadron. So those are cool. Wally, how you doing? Um, all right, that's it for this. All right, last slide into NECA Funko. Oh, you see it, guys. Got Haunt. We do have the Optimus back here hanging out. Got a Sewer Samurai Leo. Who else they got in there? Raphael. Sewer Surfer Mikey. Another Samurai. We don't even have a DVD. It's fun. Got Becky Two Belts back there. Pops, 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 pops. Joker Titan. Clayface. And that looks to be about it, guys. Toonie Terrors. Hello, YouTube. It is G Force, and we are back in the toy room. Uh, sort of hunt uh, four stores. Did three targets and Ollie's. Um, so let's just check out what we found. Uh, first, um, target we went to, home base target, we spent too much money, <laughs> but, um, it's my first time seeing Mr. T, Ultimate, and the Hulk Hogan Ultimate, so I had to scoop those up, that's just nostalgia to the core, um, my time in wrestling in the early 80s um, then just a quick step down the aisle and we found Obi-Wan for the TVC so that was cool um, next stop we went to was Ollie's and they didn't really have any toys there but um, they did have this Black Widow which I almost bought at a comic shop for $25. I know it was clearance way back. Um, but for 16 bucks, I said, heck yeah, it's got all those accessories, um, the flight stand in there with it. So for $16, it's a no-brainer all day. And then, last but not least, um, the last Target we went to found MIGs. So we got us some MIGs, Mayfield. Bill Burr in the house. Woohoo! So that's the haul. Um, pretty good. I'm trying to scope these targets out um, just because of the way they're doing resets. Um, I've been to four targets in the past three, four days, and uh, all of them are doing major resets in their toy aisles. So um, I know they just clearanced a bunch of stuff off beforehand, but um, I can only imagine that once they put the new stuff up, they're gonna still have containers coming in. That's what's happening in my best guess anyway, is that the container ships are finally releasing a ton of stuff and it's getting out to people. So these stores are having to hurry and get stuff off the shelf that's been sitting there and get the new stuff out and new stuff's going to keep coming in so hopefully we have a quick rush turnover um, here before the fall but anyway best of luck to you all on your next toy hunt please be nice to each other out there and we'll catch you on the next one take care guys